BPM. I'm here with Mahmoud, my friend, who is the guy who has the gold and silver shop that can melt us ingots. And he's got some really cool things for us. So Franklin Mint, Vice President, not President, but Vice President Nixon. And you can see it's got the box uh, for 1973. Really nice. Um, I think it's about 40 grams of silver, um, maybe more. It's huge. 200 grams. Oh, it's, 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 uh, it's 200 grams. Um, so uh, for those of you who don't know, the Franklin Mint was really a great place for medallions and, and medals and coins in the 1970s. They also had plates, all kinds of plates. Here's a silver plate with President Garfield. It's a um, different president they can get. So they have, a, I think they have all the presidents and that's a, a, a sterling silver plate. Um, very heavy plate. Hello, Del Rebbe PM again. Uh, wanted to follow up on the uh, the Franklin Mint stuff. Uh, basically, he's looking for seven hundred dollars for the Nixon commemorative. I'm not sure how much he wanted for the plate. So PM me if you're interested. All right, let me go through a couple more um, from my Farsi book of banknotes. Um, you can see it's in Farsi and in English. Some people lose their health getting wealth and then lose their wealth gaining health. Unknown. I can relate. And another uh, from Gabriel Kahal Gibran. Not sure who he is. I've heard of him. I am indeed rich since my income is superior to my expense and my expense is equal to my wishes. Uh, that's a very good philosophy. Now, one more. Benjamin Franklin again. Creditors have been have better memories than debtors. Benjamin Franklin. That's very, very good. All right. So I wanted to give you an update from my friend uh, Silver Silver Thunder from Bulgaria. He sent me some more stuff, just um, uh, stuff from the 70s and 80s uh, currency from Bulgaria. Really cool stuff. Um, and I'll be sending him out some money. Thank you very much, Silver Thunder, to get some more uh, silver from from Bulgaria. And uh, also, I would be thinking about visiting him because there's some Roman ruins, maybe doing some metal detecting there. And now, my version of uh, here's some more that's in in uh, circulation in Bulgaria right now. And now, my version of uh, coin roll hunting here in Qatar. A guy got a hold of me, saw my ads, and uh, he had all this currency here. He's a Nigerian guy, nice guy. And I bought it all for 50 QAR, all of this, uh, which is about $18. And it is worth about 74 QAR, um, or about $25. So, um, got some cool stuff for the collection, um, and mostly from the Middle East. And a Nigerian poly, um, you're a, it's a plastic note, it's very nice. And I got it for about $8 less than what it was worth. And then I also went to the Gold Souk and found some more stuff at the Gold Souk. I, uh, a little, besides this ring, I'm a little more than a, a gram now of, of scrap gold, which is really cool because it took me about three minutes to find it. So I'll keep going there and looking. So maybe this bag will be full within the next year. Anyway, uh, PM me if you're interested in those in the plates or the uh, Franklin Mint coin and uh, keep on stacking. Thank you.